We know that beans on toast is a staple of the British diet. People grow up eating beans on toast. And we also know that Americans think beans on toast is kind of a weird thing. But Americans do eat a lot of canned beans. So let's go in a grocery store and look at what the canned beans look like in the US and compare that to the same section in a British supermarket. While you don't see Heinz baked beans on the typical American supermarket shelf, you do see plenty of other kinds of baked beans. The biggest brand around here is Bush's. They've got all different kinds of beans, including pork and beans, grilling beans, but here are the original baked beans. They're similar to Heinz baked beans, but honestly a lot sweeter, which probably will not surprise many of you who think that everything we eat here in the U.S. is packed with sugar. And you're not entirely wrong. Okay, Britons, have you ever seen this? Beanie weenies, beans with hot dogs in them. In addition to baked beans, we have chili beans, of which the ranch style brand is very popular. And then we just have lots of kind of regular canned beans. Kidney beans. Red beans. Chili beans. Black beans. Cannellini beans. Great Northern garbanzo beans, aka chickpeas, butter beans, and pinto beans. Now let's go see what this same section of the store looks like at my Tesco Superstore in Cheltenham. Okay, now we're gonna look at tinned beans. And what I'll tell you is that this tinned bean section is right next to the tinned tomatoes, but it doesn't have baked beans. It's just all the other kind of regular plain beans. So everything from chickpeas, which I don't think are called garbanzo beans here at all in the UK. Then we have red kidney beans, five bean salad. Yeah, I don't think you would see that. Oh, I have never seen this in the States. Black and white chickpeas. That's amazing, that's really cool. Uh, lentils are in the bean section. Black beans in water, which actually I need some of those. Okay, here we go. Now we're talking very Texan things. Black eyed peas, more lentils. If you're American, tell me if you've ever seen canned lentils in an American supermarket. I just don't think I have. Oh, and now we have three bean salad, another mixed bean salad in vinaigrette. Yeah, never seen that in the States. Oh my goodness, taco mixed beans. Please don't say taco mix mixed beans or I'll be triggered. Oh golly, I've never seen this before in my life. Haricot beans in water? If you're British, tell me, do you say haricot or do you say haricot? I never know with British people whether they pronounce the T in French words. Because you say fillet, so I just don't know. But you say ballet, so I don't know what to think. Okay, we got butter beans. More chickpeas. Oh, here's something. Pulses. Americans, and you say to an American, where are the pulses in a grocery store? They're not gonna know what you're talking about. I mean, it is the classification, all these legumes are pulses, but that's just not a word we use, but I've seen it on signage here. I've never heard of a borlotti bean in my life. What on earth is that, and what do you use it for? And then, Oh, adzuki beans. 
I think I remember hearing about those when I worked in the Japanese ice cream category with Japanese desserts. I think it's a Japanese bean. Um, red kidney beans, lots of those. Red kidney beans in chili sauce with two L's. Fascinating. I do not approve. Those of you <laughs> who've watched my Borton on the Water video know my feelings on the topic of chili. Okay, that's regular tinned beans. Now let's go find the baked beans. Okay, this baked bean section is way bigger than the regular tinned bean section. So let's see what kind of crazy stuff we have here. All right, we have the Tesco baked beans and tomato sauce. They are rich and warming. That's funny. And then we've got the same thing with reduced sugar and salt. And the Branston reduced sugar and salt. Mixed baked beans and tomato sauce. Five beans. Ooh, I actually have never tried that, but that sounds good. Little cans of regular Branston baked beans. Please watch my baked beans tasting video to see my favorite type of baked beans. Here we go, here's the Stockwell baked beans. How are these? If you've had them, let me know in the comments. They look kind of anemic to me. They don't look super tasty. Okay, and then here's just our basic Tesco, kind of Heinz baked beans. And then Heinz baked beans, a huge stack of Heinz beans and oh, then a huge a huge stack of Branston baked beans next to it. Oh my goodness, look at this. We've got one tower of Heinz next to three towers of Branston. I'm thinking maybe people prefer the Branston around here. Although we do have the Heinz beans in these little single serving plastic snap pots and the Heinz five beans, Heinz curry beans, Heinz chili beans with two L's, Heinz barbecue beans. This is what we have a million kinds of in the US. So Heinz does have a lot more packaging varieties, so I guess they do have a fair amount of space for Heinz beans also. Oh, and over here, Heinz beans with pork sausages. Sounds terrible to me, only because I don't like sausage. Tesco's doing the same thing. <laughs> All right, that is both hilarious and horrible looking. It's like, it's trying to be a full English breakfast in a can. The full Monty. It's got baked beans, sausages, potato chunks, mushrooms. What mini bacon burgers and mini beef cutlet. All right, that does not sound good at all. But if you've had this, well, let me know. And Branston baked beans with sausages. Let me know in the comments what surprised you about this shopping comparison versus where you normally shop. And check out this other shopping video I have here. Thank you so much for watching and do something good in the world today.